The fighter jet has a number of advantages, but what are some of the most important ones? Is it the stealth speed or the most advanced weapons that really matter? There is a possibility that it is the ability to conserve money while simultaneously engaging in other activities. When it comes to the realm of modern military aviation, there are two aircraft that stand out for reasons that are extremely different from one another. When it comes to the realm of contemporary military aviation, one of Sweden's fighters is the Joss 39 Gripen, which is not only quick but also relatively affordable. Moreover, the Lightning II F-35 is obtainable. The nation of the United States of America, which is known for its audacity, resourcefulness, and technological proficiency. An example of this would be a fighter of the 4.5 generation that is easy to control and has the capability to turn about in a relatively short amount of time. Additionally, the low cost of buying it. At the opposite end of the spectrum is a stealth jet of the fifth generation which is designed to dominate the skies and is outfitted with better sensors and electronic warfare gear. Both of these options come with their own set of benefits and drawbacks, but which one particularly stands out when it comes to the count? At the present time, in order to acquire a better understanding of which fighter plane is more suitable for contemporary combat, we put them in competition with one another. To be sure, first things first, before we get into the heart of the matter, let's have a look at the wider picture of both of the competitors. This fighter, the Joss 39 Gripen, demonstrates how a fighter may be constructed in a manner that is not only efficient, but also adaptable. Through the later half of the 20th century, Saab achieved a great deal of success. As a replacement for Sweden's existing fleet, it was developed with the primary objectives of being able to carry out a diverse variety of jobs, as well as being cost-effective and capable of being deployed in a short amount of time. This item does not weigh a lot. A canard delta wing type is highly useful when it comes to maneuverability because of its particular shape. When it comes to air combat, movement is seen as being extremely quick and straightforward. Taking into account the fact that it is able to adjust to a wide variety of conditions, it is able to carry out missions such as air-to-air -air combat, ground attack, and reconnaissance. This completely changes it into an airplane that can perform multiple roles. The version that is most recent. Because of the Grapen, advanced avionics are able to have a more powerful engine than what they currently have. In addition to this, it is equipped with an enhanced electronic warfare suite, which enables it to maintain its competitive edge in the fighter aircraft battle of today. A notable addition that Sweden intends to adopt is the Taurus KE PD-350 cruise missile, which will be installed on the Creeping. This is one of the most significant enhancements that Sweden plans to implement. An offensive weapon with a long range that is capable of precision, and will have a range that is greater than 500 kilometers after it has been fully integrated by the year 2028. Because of this, the Gripen will have a much improved capability of eliminating enemy targets that are well defended from a distance. This ability will be significantly strengthened. From a performance standpoint, however, how does it stack up against the F-35? The F-35 Lightning II marks a considerable development in terms of the stealth and multi-role fighter technology that it possesses. One of the manufactured items that was produced as part of the Joint Strike Fighter program the purpose of this action was to establish a centralized site for the various branches of the United States military, as well as its allies of the United States. The stealth technology that it possesses is one of the most significant benefits that it possesses. They are able to fly into strongly protected airspace without being identified by radar, and they are also able to evade detection in the event that they are detected. In addition to giving pilots with an unprecedented understanding of the situation, and the ability to distribute real-time battle intelligence, the F-35 is outfitted with cutting-edge avionics, such as sensor fusion and network-centric warfare and other similar technologies. In conjunction with other facts and information, the basic types of fighters are divided into three categories, and each of these categories is intended to meet a certain operational purpose. In contrast, the F-35B is able to take off and land vertically and quickly, making it a great choice for amphibious assault ships. It is also capable of landing vertically. The F-35A is intended to perform the typical aircraft duties of takeoff and landing. Additionally, the F-35C has a broader wingspan than its predecessor, which contributes to its greater suitability for missions that are carried out from carriers. Additionally, landing gear that is more robust is to be included. 
At this point in time, let's put them in competition with one another. When compared to the F-35, which is only capable of reaching M1.6, the Gripen is superior to it in terms of speed and agility. There is a maximum speed of Mach 2 that the Gripen is capable of reaching. Canard Delta wings are designed to be lightweight, which makes them easier to move around. This design also makes it easier to maneuver. This makes it a good choice for dogfights because of the aforementioned reason. Despite the fact that it travels at a slower speed, the F-35 operates in a manner that is distinct. It is able to win conflicts that are hidden from view by employing stealth and sensor fusion, which enables it to strike without being discovered. This allows it to strike without being discovered. However, speed is not the only criterion that is vital. Range and firepower are also important factors to consider. In contrast to the Gripen, the F-35 has a lifetime that is significantly longer. In contrast to the Reins, which have a range of 1,500 kilometers, this one has a combat range of 2,200 kilometers, which is a huge increase. It is also capable of carrying a bigger quantity of weapons, up to 18,000 pounds, which is greater than the Reins, which are only capable of carrying 13,000 pounds. In addition, it is able to carry more weapons than the Reins. In contrast, Sweden is seeking to level the playing field by introducing the Taurus KEPD 350 cruise missile. This is an attempt to level the playing field, a firearm that is able to strike a target with a high degree of precision from a distance that is greater than 500 kilometers away when fired from a remote location, as long as the year 2028 remains. The Grapen ability to attack from a wide distance will be significantly boosted as a result of the implementation of this upgrade. When it comes to modern fighter jets, stealth is the single most important factor that sets them apart from other aircraft and the F-35 is the most advanced fighter jet in the world. The Gryphon is exceedingly tough for potential opponents to identify because it has a restricted radar cross-section and a vast amount of area for weapons within it. This makes it extremely difficult for them to be able to locate it. On the other side, it does not possess stealth shaping. Nevertheless, it makes up for this deficiency by having extremely powerful electronic warfare packages it possesses. It is able to deceive the radars of the adversary, disrupt the guidance of missiles, and camouflage itself electronically so that it is not discovered. Instead, the F-35 is one of the most helpful aircraft in contested airspace because it is able to survive near encounters with electronic warfare because to its stealth qualities. This makes it one of the most effective aircraft in contested airspace. As far as its operations are concerned, the Gripen is intended to be as versatile as is practically possible when it comes to its design. It is able to take off and land on runways that are either short or improvised, such as highways and airstrips that are located in remote areas. This gives it a major edge in decentralized operations, which is why it is so advantageous. It has a durable construction and can be utilized in a short amount of time, which indicates that it can sort a great deal of items in a small amount of time. Additionally, it has a user-friendly interface. The fact that this is the case makes it a good choice for countries that have a restricted quantity of infrastructure. On the other hand, in order for the F-35 to perform at its highest level, it would require air bases that are in good condition. It is possible that the number of missions that can be performed will be limited due to the fact that it requires a significant amount of maintenance and takes longer to maintain. The amount of time that it is able to fly is restricted on a certain level. In addition to that, the cost is an important factor to consider. The Gripen E give a significant reduction in cost, with the Gripen having a unit cost of around $85 million. In spite of the fact that it is somewhat more sophisticated than the F-35, the F-35 costs around $100 million per unit. For nations who are wanting to achieve a balance between performance and cost, the Gripen is a superior alternative because it is superior in terms of combat capability, grip, and E characteristics. Because of the large gap that exists between the two, this is not the case. It includes the Meteor missile, which is superior to other missiles when it comes to fighting in the air, as well as an electronic warfare suite that is based on gallium nitride, which enhances the possibility that it will survive in potentially hazardous scenarios. Both of these missiles are included in the package. As a further point of interest, Sweden is going to supply the Gripen the Taurus KEPD 350 missile by the year 2018. This will give the missile with the capability to carry out long-range precision hits, 
which will result in the missile having a much higher lethality. At the other end of the spectrum, the F-35 is an outstanding fighter that excels in networked battlefields. It is able to easily interact with other forces since it is outfitted with the most latest radar systems, sensor fusion, and data exchange technology. This enables it to do so with ease. Furthermore, in order to keep a dominant situational awareness over the conflict on the global arena, the F-35 has obtained widespread adoption with over 1,000 aircraft being deployed to 17 different countries. This action was taken in order to maintain a dominant, situational awareness. As a consequence of this, the fighter of the fifth generation is the one that is utilized the most frequently. In spite of the fact that it is utilized in Sweden, Brazil, Thailand, and Hungary, the Gripen is not exported to the same extent as it is in other nations. The Air Force places a significant focus on cost-effectiveness, and this product is a good competitor for that priority. Having the ability to successfully adapt to new circumstances and carry out a wide range of jobs. To answer your question, which of these two fighter jets do you think is most advanced? To this point, there is nothing else. The fact that you watched is well appreciated.